Hey guys, I wanted to share our Canada map with you today. So, um, I want you to first, in the top right hand corner, I want you to write that the test will be on September the 10th. Okay, so um, that means the test will be next Thursday, so you have seven nights to study. You will also be able to go to Classwork in my Google Classroom and uh, look under Resources and go to Hobson's Landing Page. And uh, when you click on the globe on Hobson's Landing Page, uh, it will bring you to a Canada map practice for online. Okay, so first we're going to look at the top three territories on the map. All the way to the left is the Yukon. I'm going to try and zoom in for you. All right, and then to, just to the right of the Yukon is the Northwest Territories. And then the final top territory is called Nunavut. And all of these glaciers and little islands to the north are all part of Nunavut. Even all the way over here to this sideways llama. Now the final ten are not called territories, they're called provinces. But territories and provinces are just another fancy word for states. Just like in the United States, we have 50. You, uh, I mean, Canada only has 13. So all the way to the west, we have British Columbia. Then we have Alberta. And then, this is my favorite, this is called Saskatchewan, and so we try to say that uh, this is where the Sasquatch live. Our next territory is, I mean, I'm sorry, province, is going to be Manitoba. And then we have Ontario, and some of you might have heard about Ontario. Ontario and the next province is Quebec. These two have the highest population in Canada. Okay, right above Ontario is the Hudson Bay. And that's going to be water. And just below are the Great Lakes. I'm going to zoom in a little bit more. Now they, they consider these two provinces to be one, even though they have two separate names. Now, um, during the European exploration, about the time of Christopher Columbus, we had a European explorer by the name of John Cabot. Now, he must not have been very um, creative because he called this territory Newfoundland. Newfoundland. Can you open that door for me? And this one right here, the sh in the shape of an L, is Labrador. Hold on just a second, sorry. That's okay. Um, really on the Uh-huh. Just going to do a long time for okay. and Sophie Bergeron and Sophie Bracken. Y'all are supposed to be in my third period. Check out. It's not y'all coming on the first period, the second period. So you gotta switch it to E, then send me. 
because I was like, I finally got a list of mm -hmm. see because I have kids that are missing uh -huh. and some in the wrong class. Okay. So them three, you can let them know to switch their. Sure. So is. she comes to you first and they come to you after PD. Yes. Okay. I'll let them know. Because I'm like, something's not right here. I can uh -huh. tell the difference. And I got some kids going to PD class. Oh, <laughs> no. I'm, I'm so sorry. So I was just wondering. Sure. Thank you. Well, they're going to start going to the different, a different one now. All right. And so our last three provinces are going to be right here. So what I want you to do is I want you to find the alligator right here. It looks like his mouth is open and here's his tail. Okay. We're going to draw a little arrow out here. And a little arrow back down to the alligator, and we're going to say his name is Prince Edwards Island. And then we have the rooster on top of this country. This is going to be Nova Scotia. Sorry, guys. And remember, that's both this and this. And then this last one right here is New Brunswick. Now, the last three things that you'll need to know for your map test are the oceans. I'm going to zoom back out. Maybe. Okay. So if you look right here where this bump is, that is Maine. And so it comes down, and this is a part of the United States. On this side, where the end of British Columbia is, this is where Washington State, Oregon, and Northern California are. So on this side of the United States and Canada, we have the Pacific Ocean. And to the north, we have the Arctic Ocean. Remember to put that C in the middle of Arctic. And then all the way to the east, we have the Atlantic Ocean. So you're going to finish up today with your map. Looking like this. And so I put an acronym down here, no, uh, a mnemonic device, sorry, for all of your provinces at the bottom of Canada. B for British Columbia would start with Billy. And it will be Billy and Sally made our queen nervous playing near needles. Hey guys, hope that helps. Um, if you have any questions, just send me um, a, a question through Google Classroom or you can send me a question through online. Hope you all have a great day.